Hello, my name is Brooke Lester. I'm at Garrett Evangelical Theological Seminary, and today I'm going to show you how to download and install the SBL Hebrew Unicode font onto a Macintosh machine. Uh, you probably already have, in fact, you certainly have, fonts pre-installed on your machine that are Unicode and include Hebrew characters. Uh, and if you view something that's written in Hebrew Unicode, it, your machine will choose one of those fonts, um, like Lucida Grand Unicode or something like that, and it'll work out just fine. But uh, some of these fonts are less readable than others. None of them are really beautiful. Uh, the SBL Hebrew Unicode font is a, a wonderfully viewable, really good-looking Hebrew Unicode font. Uh, so I recommend when you're viewing something that's in Hebrew Unicode, using that font whenever possible. So let's take a look at how to download and install that. Um, we are going to find it at the website of the Society of Biblical Literature. So here in my web browser, I'm using Chrome. You can use Firefox or Safari or uh, any browser. And I'm going to type in sbl hyphen site dot org sblsite.org. I hit return, and here we are at the home page of the Society of Biblical Literature. And in the left sidebar here, we want educational resources. And I click on that piece, and it opens a submenu that includes biblical fonts. And I click on biblical fonts. This gives me a page that has two biblical fonts, SBL Greek and SBL Hebrew. We want SBL Hebrew, so I click on that hyperlink, SBL Hebrew font. Now here, there's the font download, and then there's stuff like keyboard drivers and user manuals. Keyboard drivers and user manuals are useful if you plan to be typing in SBL Hebrew Unicode font, uh, creating documents that use the font. Let's assume for the time being that you just want to be able to read or view something that another person has created using a Hebrew Unicode font. So we're going to do font down, and then for that all we need is the font. So font download, and if I look at my downloads, sometimes a downloads window will come up right away. But if I look at my downloads folder, there's the item. And I can just double click on the item, And it produces, that activates the font book on the Macintosh operating system, and it includes install font. Now, for some reason, it always says not installed. Even though I already have this font installed, it'll always say not installed here. Uh, maybe it just means the, the specific file that I just downloaded. So all I do is I click install font, validates it, and installs it. And there it is in my font book, SBL Hebrew. I'm all set. I can just close that up, and I've got the font available to me. Uh, so, for example, if I want to see it, I can go to the application Anki, which is a flashcard application, and I've already created some decks that use SBL Hebrew. Uh, I'll go to a recent one. And if I review that deck, there's the first word seem in lovely Hebrew characters using the SBL Hebrew Unicode font. And that's it. Uh, I hope you found this helpful. And thank you very much for watching and listening. Goodbye.